Hi, how are you? My name is Pete and in this quick video I'm gonna show you exactly how to get both of the new tracks from Phase 6 DLC. So without wasting any time, let's start with the easiest one of them too. The track I'm talking about is Aramatsu Forester. Now before we start, just want to mention that make sure that your map is aligned the same way as mine so you won't get confused. And as you can see, the track is located on the first map, the lowland. So the garage is pretty much in the center of the map. And if you travel south towards this point here, where it says Abandoned Titan, that's the mission that you have to do in order to get the truck. Now the mission is very simple, all you gotta do is just repair and refuel the truck. So you can actually come prepared before even activating the mission. And in case you're wondering, to fix and refuel the truck you need 651 repair points and 313 liters of fuel. And as usual remember to fix the truck first before refueling it so you won't lose any fuel. And once you refuel and repair the truck, the truck is yours and you can recover it to your garage. In case you didn't unlock all the features in your garage yet and you want to fix your truck, all you gotta do is just put your truck into the truck storage, travel to other map, take the truck out of the truck storage and take it outside of the garage and then recall it back to the garage. That way it will automatically be fixed and refueled. And that also applies to any other truck that you're gonna need to refuel or repair while working on this new map. Now let's move on to the second truck and the the second truck you can get in this new DLC, it's Tega 6455B. And to get it, you need to do a couple of missions. Now the main mission to unlock the truck, it's called starting the plank production. But as you can see on the top left hand corner, it's locked, which means that you need to complete a different mission first. And that mission is the sawmill, the final stage. However, if you go to sawmill, the final stage missions, that one is also locked and it requires you to complete the mission trailer with the new equipment. But guess what? That one is also locked and to get access to this mission you need to complete the old sawmill mission first. Now luckily the old sawmill mission is unlocked and you're actually able to complete it straight away. Also before you start doing any missions I would recommend that you at least upgrade your garage a little bit. If you don't want to unlock everything in the garage yet, I would at least recommend you complete the cleaning out the garage mission, which will give you an access to four metal beams just beside the garage. And I would also strongly recommend to get the trailer st store going, because that way you will have access to all the trailers. So fixing and refueling your truck won't be that big of a deal. Otherwise you will have to travel to other maps just to get it done. Now of course you can do those missions however you like, but I'm gonna give you a few pointers just to make your life easier. Now the old sawmill mission requires you to deliver 4 metal beams, 4 cement and 2 concrete slab as well as 4 cabins. So you gain the access to 4 metal beams just outside your garage, just right here on the map, as soon as you fix the garage. It's that cleaning out the garage mission. Now the cement and concrete slab you can get from the a warehouse located on the north part of the map just right here. Now once you deliver all of the materials and you want to start constructing the cabins, here is what you need. You need altogether four cargo containers and you need eight wooden planks in order to construct four cabins. And a very good place for wooden planks is the warehouse on the north part of the map. As you can see it has 12 wooden planks so it's more than enough and you get unlimited cargo containers just on the pier. And once you construct and deliver all the cabins, you're one mission closer to get your taiga. So the next mission is trailer with new equipment and it requires you to deliver the trailer back to the sawmill. The problem however is that the trailer is located on the second new map, the Yellow Rock National Forest. And if you look at the east side of the map, you will notice that the gateway has a lock on it which means that it's locked behind the mission. However, two of the gateways are locked, but there is a third gateway which is located just on the north side of the map and that one is completely unlocked. So you can freely use it without doing any additional missions. And once you use that gateway, you will appear at the very bottom of the second map. The trailer, however, of course, is on the top right hand corner of the map. 
but it's not as bad as it seems because the road to get to the trailer is actually quite simple. You just follow the main road all the way around. The only difficulty you may encounter is the lack of the bridge at the very top of the map but considering that you have to use the scout for this mission you shouldn't have a problem going around it also keep in mind that that map is mainly snow and ice map so come prepared once you finally deliver the trailer you're two missions down and you can start the third mission which is called so meal the final stage now for this mission you only need four consumables and four metal rolls now the four metal rolls you can get at the warehouse just on that little island just east of your garage and you get unlimited supplies of consumables down at the pier so that mission is pretty easy and pretty straightforward and once you finish this mission you only have one more mission to go and the last mission is starting the plant production mission again that mission is pretty simple and pretty straightforward all you gotta do is deliver different sizes of logs Back to the sawmill and you can get all sizes of logs just at the log station just east of your garage however do remember that you need a different add-ons or your truck based on which logs you want to transport and if you don't have your garage fully operated yet you're gonna have to transfer to other map to change the add-on on your truck and then come back here and here's where it gets interesting as you can see i'm just about to deliver my last logs and for some reason the game booked out on me now, I'm not sure what happened, but it just didn't let me deliver the last logs. So I don't know if the game freaked out because my garage wasn't fully operated yet and it couldn't give me the truck or what happened. But upon restarting the game, the mission was already marked as done. And even though I didn't get the truck, I was able to buy it from the truck store. Now, I hope I'm, you're going to have more luck with that than me, but in case something weird like that happened to you as well, please let me know in the comments. But either way, I did get the truck in the end, I just had to pay for it. Now, I hope you find this video useful. If you did, please leave a like and consider subscribing. And I'll see you in the next one. Thank you.